All right, 1246 on this Thursday afternoon, April snowstorms. Historically, we've had snow in April uh, as much as 14 inches of snow on April 16, set back in 1921, 1973, April 9th. We had 11.6 inches of snow. That's why am I showing you this? Well, we do have some snow on the way for Saturday, but I did actually want to show you there's a little glimmer of hope here. Notice how most of these uh, numbers here, and they're quite a bit, have been in the first half of April. So we're now on the tail end of April, so it's going to be very, very tough historically to see amounts like this, but I do think we will get some accumulation as we head on into Saturday afternoon. All right, currently in West Bend 64, there was Milwaukee downtown uh, towards the Marquette interchange where it's 61 degrees. Winds out of the east southeast at 10 miles per hour. Until then, we got some nice weather. Very nice this early afternoon. You got 66 in Watertown, cooler near the lake. Port Washington, you know how it is this time of year, 52. Sheboygan, though, a little away from the lake at the airport there at 64. All right, weather headlines, we go through it here. Another nice day for today. Showers move in this evening for most of us. Maybe Maybe a little bit sooner for our northwestern spots and then that snow on Saturday. Storm four max radar across southeastern Wisconsin. We're enjoying nice sunny skies to the northwest of us. This area of rain has been crawling towards us through the morning hours and it will continue to crawl towards us as we head into this evening, maybe affecting again our northwestern spots up towards Fond du Lac uh, during the afternoon hours. So let's go through our future forecast has a pretty good handle on this uh, cold front drops down and with it by five o'clock locations northwest of the Milwaukee metro area. We're talking Dodge County, Jefferson County, uh, Fond du Lac County uh, starting to see some of those showers. Look what happens though by around uh, eight, nine o'clock. This rain becomes likely for everybody in southeastern Wisconsin. Then the cold front clears through, and I think by the time we wake up tomorrow morning, 5, 6 o'clock, any chance of rain should be out of here. We'll be enjoying a lot of sunshine during the day on Friday. Another nice day. Northwest breeze, though. It'll be quite breezy out of the northwest, uh, but a decent day on Friday. Now, Friday night, clouds start to thicken up. As high pressure breaks down, we're going to look for this swath of rain and snow. Here it is by 11 o'clock approaching, if not here, in southeastern Wisconsin. I think our precipitation chances ramp up uh, the afternoon on Saturday. How much rain tonight? Quarter to a half inch of rain will be possible. How much snow? This is the European computer model. I think it has a really good handle on snow amounts as of right now. And it looks to be about two to three inches for most of southeastern Wisconsin. A wide swath of two to three inches a very wet slushy snow and most of this would be on the grassy surfaces unless we get a heavy burst of snow then we could get some slush on the concrete. Okay, your forecast for today 64 degrees, partly cloudy, turning cooler lake to towards the lake. For tonight, 45 degrees, mostly cloudy with some showers likely. Here's a 7-day forecast. Try to ignore Saturday, right? You heard enough about that. Uh, 50 on Sunday, a little bit better. Any snow that we do have on the ground will melt away on Sunday, even though it'll only be 50. Sun is so strong this time of year, it'll melt it away quickly. Uh, rain likely on Monday, 50 degrees, 52 on Tuesday. Rain and thunderstorms likely on Wednesday with a high temperature of 55 degrees. And we'll be right back.